hey what's up what's up thank you for tuning into the channel once more it's your boy spree 876 again with you with another one guys i went out and got me a camera people so basically this camera guys what it does it's the best vlogging camera in the world right now have a look at that all right no joke in the universe in the planet <laughs> it's the best camera in the world right now so i got the vlogging camera zv e10 and that's from sony so guys literally um what this camera does it opens a gate for amazing content so it's a it's an interchangeable it has inter interchangeable lens um has loads of accessory that comes with it um it has a tripod mount that gives you amazing access to record slash zoom in zoom out it also comes with guys it comes with uh, wind muff camera wind muff that's it uh the sony zv e10 is a vlogging camera made specially for people like myself who does youtube contents for you if you do youtube contents this is the camera for you i literally saw a couple of uh review online and i thought to myself yo you know what let me actually get this camera so i put my mind into it man and i literally got this camera this week i've been testing it out it's an amazing camera um, it records really well one of the thing the reason why I got it is because I had my Nikon which is here I had my start yeah my Nikon uh, D 5600 right and this camera quite good don't get me wrong it literally does the job I'm not gonna lie to you it does the job it's a good photo camera as well so if I want to take good pictures quite expensive this comes in about I mean, the lens is about 600 the lens is more expensive than the camera yes so I had this for a while and when I had this for a while I was like yo you know what let me upgrade my thing and I always got problem with um like when I'm shooting videos the autofocus is not as good it's good but then I would need good lighting you know what I mean so one of the reasons why I got this camera now which is this one in front of you example if I put this here you see it gives you that um, that focus on the actual camera and then on me there's a blur so it focuses on whatever subject is in front of it so this is one of the reasons why I got this camera peeps I really do really do love this camera I think it's an amazing piece there's so much to it so much to it it does use a lot of lenses you can use the Sigma lens on this but it's easily compact and it's easy to carry around you know what I mean this is one of the reasons why I gravitate to this camera um, I think this is gonna definitely do my YouTube channel really really good um, me going around with this camera and so forth easy to take around so this is the inner, inner box I've actually opened the camera already so the camera that I'm using now is actually the camera that I'm recording right now so it comes with loads of like stuff in there like you get like your little booklets telling you about the camera and stuff like that so loads of stuff in there. loads of information on like if you want to get lenses uh, loads of information regarding apps and so forth in different languages this is the manual the manual is not as it comes with every single language there is and literally it's the English version if you want to see the English the stuff in English is about that thick so it's not that a lot of information but you would definitely need to play around with this camera to get two features and stuff that will benefit you like i've done this video example over four times okay i did this video four times and i literally get to some settings and now i'm comfortable with how it looks with the lighting that's that i'm using uh, so you definitely out of the pack i think there is so much more to this camera if you just open it up and start recording i think you'll be missing out on some cool features so going into the box as you guys can see the camera is actually out of the box the camera i'm using right now which i'll show you a video of that and it comes with this so this is like a charger so you can actually charge the camera by plugging this into the camera and then your your port into the wall the wall port and charge it that way the thing that i did though right because getting this camera i've seen online where people go ahead and purchase extra battery so this is new more new more <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Anyway, people, this um extra battery, you plug it in like so, and it's like so. 
you plug this into any um, like adapter like a power bank people right you got a power bank you could actually plug it in your power bank and charge it at the same time so let's see if this works. this is a power bank and let's see if the light comes on okay turn it on power bank is on as you can see the lights on here and then let's see if the, it works oh look it works so the good thing about this is you can put this on a power bank example if you're shooting outside or, or so forth you could actually put this on a power bank and let me turn this light back off yeah lights off so you could actually put this on a power bank and charge this battery on the go so yeah it's worth getting guys it's worth getting if you guys are going to get this camera it's worth getting this um extra battery pack from a new moa <laughs> New more, new more. Uh, so yeah. Anyway, guys, uh, the camera is absolutely on point, guys. I'm not gonna lie to you. The autofocus is good. You literally just put set the camera on you, and you don't need to do nothing else. Like now, I don't need to do anything else. I literally could just sit here and do whatever I want to do. So what I did, guys, is I went ahead and purchased myself. Um, some stuff for the studio. So now the studio is up and running. I'm just bringing this to you guys a Sony ZV E10 to let you know that I've Invested in the YouTube man, and we're going all out with this this new Stuff that we're bringing the contents that we have. There's so much stuff that I have to bring out to you guys So yeah, this is the um, This is actually the the camera. That's how it looks so you could use a Sigma um lens on there you could get a sigma lens that actually goes with the camera um, there's a couple compatible ones on on um amazon that i've seen that we can work with this so this sigma lens is quite good um wide lens yes wide lens yes uh so i'll definitely be investing in a lens with this camera soon but for now i'm just using the normal lens because i find that it does it does the job perfectly uh, this this camera now will set you back about seven hundred pounds, seven fifty, uh, and a couple companies in the UK that has it. You have to shop around. They do sell it on Amazon as well, but I didn't buy mine on Amazon. I got mine from another independent company in the UK. Um, that I find that I just needed the camera the next day, <laughs> and I want it now. You know, but don't get me wrong, it did come the next day actually. But I could have got it on Amazon for the. But I think not everything on Amazon is cheap. Okay, sometimes it's good to shop around. So yeah, that's the camera right here, guys. I'm totally, totally happy with it. I went ahead and also got me another amazing piece that I'm not gonna show on this video. I'm gonna save this one. This one in here, I literally waited forever to get it and now I finally get it. Uh, I'm just gonna give you guys a sneak peek for the next video. So the next video I'll be talking about, if you know what this is, guys, have a look. That is, YOLO Box Pro. So that is something that I'll be talking about in the next video. Uh, that video is for the next video, but this one is for the ZV E10, people like me. So you, you go on YouTube and you see like a lot of people reviewing this product. They're giving you the in-depth in information about the camera. I'm just the normal guy who just purchased the camera. So I'm not gonna give you no in-depth information about it. I'm gonna tell you how it does it suit me. And I'm, I'm sure that somebody out there that's looking to get this camera wants to know from the actual person who purchased the camera, how does it benefit them? So let me tell you. Um, if you have a DSLR camera or your mobile phone, because I use my mobile phone to record as well, and it does amazing jobs as well. But I find that this camera gives you a different level of playing field. It records in 4K. Um, it's just an all-around camera. So you know what I mean? If you do not want to have your phone all the time recording, this is the, the camera to, to record it. So it, these cameras finish, they do 20 minutes. I don't know what happened in the UK. I think somebody was saying to me because of tax purposes or something like that. They only do them in the UK 20 minutes. You can't record over 20 minutes on a DSLR camera. Apparently, it would have cost it would class as a camcorder if it does record over 20 minutes. But with this small baby here, it records um, as long as the memory card is is. If so, the memory card is like 
you name it, 200 gigabytes it records, as long as you got battery in this camera, you know. So yeah, there you go, people. There's a couple of batteries you can get. You can get this battery here. This is charging by, as you can see, this is a power bank, and I'm charging it with a power bank. Uh, so you can get that with, with this camera here. Um, and you can also get a camera, um, you can also get, there is one on Amazon that I need, I'm going to get eventually. And this one is a, um, it's actually a battery that goes in the camera permanently. You just, no, not permanently, you just put it in and you actually plug it in the wall, the wall mount at the same time and it charges it, it keeps the power going. And that is something that I will be definitely possibly investing in. Uh, but for now, I'm satisfied where I'm at with this camera. And um, there's a couple more things I've seen on YouTube that I can get for it, which is a I got a, um, a filter, a M N D, so N D filter. Uh, you can get them on Amazon for about 19 pounds. So that goes onto the camera lens, and the, you know if you're recording outside. The other one is the Sony GPV PT two BT hand grip. So that one there is the hand grip I was telling you guys about. You can use that for, you know, it, it works with Bluetooth with the, with the camera and you could just record. It has a zoom in, zoom out button. Also have a button for uh, taking photos. So if you need to take a photo, you press that button and it takes a photo. So it's like a tripod, it hangs onto the camera. The next thing that I wanna get is this um, Sigma lens, 30 millimeter f14 lens i'll definitely get that and also guys if you need microphone good microphone is the v mic d4 mini it has two microphones one in the front one in the back and that's quite good uh the tripod that i look for this camera here another tripod that you can get is actually this one here this one here on amazon is about 16 pounds that's really good mt04 mini um, and it does a amazing thing. It literally can expand like you can go forward back You know, you can like use it as a tripod walking. So while you're walking you could be recording with this camera um, It's quite good. So those are little things that I've seen um, that I will definitely in the future um, Invest in and then just to build up my um, Yeah, my collection on this camera so yeah, people, this that's information from a, a normal consumer, a normal guy that just purchased this camera and not the, the guys that knows everything about cameras. I'm just a normal guy that just wants clean video, crisp video, 4K. Uh, when, you, when, I, when I connect my microphone, it's perfect. It doesn't cut off in 20 minutes. It records forever. And uh, my video looks clean and the autofocus is absolutely amazing, guys. Look at that. So, you know, it's amazing. It focuses on whatever you put in front of it and then blurs the background out. There's so much things you can do with this camera. You can blur the background out, you can do so much stuff, you know? So anyway, guys, I brought to you this camera. It's my first um, Sony camera. It's a ZV-E10. Uh, I'm very, very proud of it. Like, super excited about it. Um, yeah, so I would say, guys, if you're looking for a good vlogging camera, this is a camera for you, as you see, made for vloggers. So if you're a vlogger, they, Sony really took the time out to make it for you, man. Let's go. So yeah, anyway, people, thank you for watching and uh, thank you for subscribing to the channel. I greatly, greatly appreciate and do appreciate every single one of you. Um, you know, keep liking. You know what time it is, man. Peace.